right, so to start off, you gotta click on motor and sensor setup. And this page will pop up and you have to choose the port. You have to name it so that when in the code, when you're trying to access that port, you just type in whatever you named it as. And if you're doing the drivetrain, you should probably name it like front right, front left, uh, back right, back left as it is right here. Whether the reverse box is checked or not depends on if the motor's wire was flipped when putting into the Cortex or if you're choosing to do it through the program. So after uh, doing the first part and naming all the ports and assigning them to a specific motor, the next step is to add a while statement. And a while true statement basically translates to loops forever. And it'll continuously go as long as you press the button that you assigned the motor to on the controller. So if I make my button the right joystick, as long as I move it, the bot will continuously move. And the way you assign a control to a specific motor is through the channels. Here's an example of a controller and the 4 and 3 and the 2 and 1 next to the joysticks are the channels. Here's an example of a finished drivetrain code for tank treads. By tank treads, I mean the left joystick will control the left side of the drivetrain and the right joystick will control the right side. As you can see, the front right and the back right are using the same channel, which is channel 3, which is connected to the right joystick, and the back left and the front left are using channel 2, which is the left joystick. Remember to double check if the motor's wire that is plugged into the Cortex is reversed or not, because then you will have to go back into the motor and sensor setup and check the reversed box. As you can see, there's another way to reverse the motors, which is putting the negative one to the right, as you can see right here. Um, that's just another way to do it if you didn't check the reversed box in the motors and sensor setup area. And yeah, that's about it. Another video just like this is coming out soon, but this time for Autonomous. Make sure you check that out, and I'll see you in the next one.